Jane, to right here in Northeast Ohio, a family's long journey from their war-torn homeland to a local neighborhood here. First at four, Vic Gideon found they're adjusting now to a whole new life made possible by some people's generosity. A young mother and her five-year-old daughter, Yeva, enjoying the last days of summer before kindergarten starts Friday. The family also adjusting to their new surroundings. Change country, it's not so easy. It's a difficult. <laughs> It's a difficult. Christina Babilova has been in Cleveland just three weeks. It's her new home. She left her native Ukraine more than a year ago. Her journey over the last year to keep her family safe, incredible. Yeah, very happy. A lot of people help for us and we want to say thank you. Christina, her husband and daughter first traveled to Europe, then to Canada, and finally to living in a house next to Our Lady of Peace Church at Shaker Square. Their house uh, was totally destroyed by a bomb. You wouldn't even know it was a house if you were looking at it. It's just a pile of rubble. When we left, it was very difficult. Our Lady of Peace in Shaker Square, one of the four parishes that through their fundraising efforts were able to bring this family from the Ukraine to the United States. This fundraiser at St. John Vianney, as well as efforts at Sacred Heart in Wadsworth, St. Charles Borromeo in Parma, and Our Lady of Peace brought the family here. It's kind of like almost in the DNA of our parish. When uh, Sister Rita Mary Harwood uh, needed to place for a Ukrainian refugee family, she called us right away. And Global Cleveland helped get the family to the United States for at least two years. Because we don't know what uh, will be in the future, we don't know nothing. Yeah. Vic Gideon, 19 News.